Good morning, it's October 23rd. Um, it is 6.20 in the morning and I'm here at a Walmart because I'm picking up some Halloween costumes that sold over the weekend. I listed all of these without actually ever grabbing them, so hopefully they're still in here. Um, but this costume just dropped at Walmart recently. I had somebody give me a good lead on it and I went and bought mediums. The mediums all sold out super fast, I bought 10 of them. I'm bringing this video to you so hopefully you can get out if you watch it today, you can find these costumes and sell them within the next two to three days. Customers are gonna be buying all these costumes with expedited shipping, so you wanna make sure that your shipping templates are set up correctly. That way you are capitalizing on the expedited shipping cost. So let's go into Walmart, hopefully they're still there. All right, so here is the costume. It's this Ted Lasso. Um, you know, so the medium one was selling really good, but the extra large, I did sell a few. Um, I am going to go ahead and show you all, um, when I get home, how to hide these, um, price tags. There's also two other ones inside. Some people care about the fact that it says find at walmart.com. I'll show you what I do with that. And there's also a hidden price tag inside the costume that you have to be watching out for. All right. So we got our three extra larges and we do have one large right in here so got my large so we are good to go let's go ahead and get these shipped out the door today all right so we got all four on here i'm gonna go pay 105 dollars 87 cents okay so first thing i'm doing taking these black labels and i'm going to put these over the price tag to make it a little bit harder to see all right so label going on and i'm just going to kind of simply cover it up just like that. And then I also went ahead and printed the FNSQ labels. So basically, if you were to ship these FBA, you would get these labels. And then I just take one of these labels and then I'll cover that over the black part. That way you don't see the price of the original part coming through. It just looks like there's a nice barcode right there. And if you peel that off, you'll get the black label underneath. Same thing for the back one. Just because it says find more at walmart.com, I'm just going to go ahead and kind of hide that one up as well nice and easy most people aren't taking the time to peel those and then lastly there is another guy this tag right here this also says $24.97 again i sold this guy for like $76.99 i don't really understand why people choose to pay this but they do and since they want to buy them i'll sell it to them so i'm gonna cut this off and then get this packaged up All right, and I guess the last thing to do is just drop them off here at the post office and then I got a few at UPS. 